What's up, y'all? This is I Rise here too, and it's your man Vince. Now, uh, go ahead and subscribe and hit that bell so you'll be alerted to my newest uh, uploads. So today we're going to talk about uh, the ratings protection that Uber offers. Now, the last time I spoke about this, my last video, I said that they're not allowing you to say that a, a rider is rude and have that cancel out their low ratings of you. For a while, they were letting us do that. In fact, um, it let me uh, bring up my ratings from a seven point, uh, excuse me, yeah, uh, 4.71 all the way up to, I think I got as high as uh, uh, 4.8 or 4.81 or something like that. And, uh, and then it got as high as uh, 4.84 and then came down a couple of notches and now it's at a 4.82. But what happened was at one time I noticed that I had uh, submitted that a couple of riders was rude and my points came down and they didn't go back up. So it led me to figure that Uber was a, had uh, killed that type of uh, procedure or uh, policy but they really didn't they just modified it and I figured out what they did so it's true that if you have uh, uh, someone that rates you low once upon a time you could have said that they were rude and your rating would go back up they would nullify their low rating but you can't just do that now. What you have to do now is claim that the, the rider uh, made you feel unsafe. And if you say that a rider made you feel unsafe, then it will nullify their rating. All right, and you can um, protect yours by doing this. Now, what type of types of things can a rider do to make you feel unsafe other than the obvious, you know? If they're yelling and screaming, of course, that'll make you feel unsafe. But uh, I've claimed riders were unsafe if they play their devices too loud, which distracts me while I'm driving. That is unsafe. I've had people, I told them, could they lower their device, and they refused to do it. And that is uh, distracting my driving ability. And in the uh, guide, uh, on how to act, I don't know the precise name of it, a uh, guy of uh, code of conduct or whatever it is, it states that writers should, if they're on the phone, they need to keep their voices down. I had a young lady just recently, somebody that she was talking to, uh, I guess they couldn't hear, she started yelling on the phone. I had to raise my hand and say, excuse me, could you not yell that loud? Um, in the vehicle like that. She was acting like I'm not even in the car. Well, she thought she must have thought she was in uh, one of those uh, um, driverless cars or something like that. I was like the nerve of her to raise her voice to that level. I'm talking about as loud. She was yelling. And you know, you have those type of patterns. And then she gave me a low rating. I know it was her because my rating dropped down. But it came back up when I said that she made me feel unsafe. So, if a rider makes you feel unsafe, and you know how uh, riders are, they'll uh, give you a low rating if you uh, ask them in the most polite terms to be agreeable in whatever type of way. So that will help to protect your rating. You can't just say that they were rude. That's not going to work anymore. But what will work if you say that they made you feel unsafe in any form of fashion. So I hope this helps um, and uh, I want you guys to subscribe, like, share and uh, you new cats use my referral code to get that bonus money if you're starting to drive for Uber or Lyft. And if you don't like the video don't forget to subscribe, like, share, you new cats use that referral code. You know, until the next video remember as always y'all stay safe out there no matter what. And, you know, uh, speaking of which this video is all about, um, 
uh, uh, pastor just making us feel unsafe. But y'all stay safe out there. Uh, remember, there's only one of you, so um, you got to uh, uh, keep yourself in, uh, in a good place. So um, until the next time, peace.